Podcast with WW Beds Custom Furniture. And this is a Murphy bed that my crew and I just completed for you. It's our Manhattan Murphy bed with a sofa. We designed the sofa a little bit different this time. We did a thinner arm to give it more of a contemporary look to it, uh, which also allowed us to thin out these uh, thicker uh, verticals. The, the thick, thicker verticals are needed for dead space for the arms. Uh, normally it's about six inches. We did these at four inches to give it more streamlined look, of course. Um, but basically, we, we did this unfinished in maple. Uh, you're going to cover it with laminate. The only th uh, thing that you may have to do is we made the bed stop on the inside removable. Uh, that way you could uh, laminate it, push it back. But everything else should be pretty straightforward on, on, you, on putting the laminate on there. Uh, but to use the sofa, uh, basically just remove the cushions. And inside the, uh, underneath the cushions, we have storage. Uh, so you have storage and uh, put the linens and things like that under there. Uh, also, you know, to open up the bed, since we don't have the hardware on there yet, uh, you'll be adding that. I have to grab it from the side. But uh, really easy to operate and to use. Flip around the leg. Go and take it all the way down to the ground. We have added lights in here. So you have the, the three stage touch dimmer. You have low, medium, high, and then off again. And again, here's this bed stop that uh, we said you can remove. Uh, when you put the laminate on it, you may have to set back uh, slightly uh, to accommodate the thickness of the, of the face. But other than that, when you're ready for the sofa back, simply pick up the bed, rotate the leg, close the face. There you have it. The Manhattan Murphy bed I gave it a style number of 152-1023 with the sofa from WW Beds Custom Furniture.